Oh, that's a big branch. It snapped right here. Yeah, should be just fine. Perfect. Those little signs give it away, you know? Before you get into the dirt. I'm gonna shoot this line up into it. Shoot it halfway up, do a base tie on it, hook it up to the mini, pull it over. This is my slingshot. There are many like it, but this one is mine. Nope. That might work. I'm gonna give it a shot. But what I'll do is uh, pull the rope up through it and then we'll put pressure on it and see how it reacts, but this should work. And it's pretty far away from the base. Ideally, it's really close to the base, but what I'm gonna do is hook this line up, you know, pull this line up through the tree, and then we'll see what kind of maneuvering we can do with it. Probably attach to the skid steer and put some pressure on it and see if we can break some of those branches. Get it closer to the tree. All right, go ahead. There goes the rope. I need to be way closer to that tree, so we'll see if we can make this happen or not. Okay, we don't need a ton of pull on it. It's not leaning back too hard. And you can see just by us wrenching on it, it's moving the tree already. So I'm going to put this around the tree and do a running bowling on it. And we'll be able to pull on that really hard. Okay. So we're just, right now, we're breaking the loose branches that it's on. Good! So we got a ton of pull on this tree, the way that's set up. Now it's broken through the branches. So now we'll just reset this up so he's further back. All right, we are hooked up. And I'm gonna put some wedges in the back of this tree, just in case as we're pulling it over, a, a limb breaks and it puts slack in the system. I'll have a wedge in the back of it already. There's some hangers coming down. Oh, see now the tree's starting to move. Oh, that was a big branch. It snapped right here. That's good. We've got a lot of pull on it right now. Yeah, should be just fine. 500 eye. Love this saw. No issues ever with it. It's great. Back cut. This is a 32 inch bar. It's going to use up most of it. Excellent. Really good hinge. Good hinge wood. It's perfect right there. We didn't hit the maple. <laughs> Heck, we didn't even break the log. Came down perfect. This is a dead tree. You didn't even crack the log. Not that we're gonna... It's going to some lower income folks. It's all free. We just give it to them for free. But that's a perfect shot. What is wrong with this guy? Off with his hands.
the idea there at the end to keep your bar from these from pinching slow the slow the progress through the wood down and then keep your rpms high it'll just keep going through it and it won't just stop <laughs> You want to drive through here and get these branches out of the way? That makes life easy. Er, easier. If only we could just put that into a trailer and dump it. The chips are staying here, so we're going to chip it. We'll see if you can move those. The machine's supposed to be able to lift a thousand pounds, but yeah, it's a balance thing too as well, so. Drag it back there. You can't you can't lift it? No, it's too big. Too big. heavy but it's not a thousand pounds got this thing in half it's too heavy to lift <laughs> little signs give it away you know before you get into the dirt the 500i and the 261 my two main saws that i use for entry or little stuff and then for entry or big stuff i use them both on my hip tree there and there was a tree there and now they're gone see you next time <laughs>